Picks 106. 1-800-LAW-1010, 1-800-LAW-1010.com. We welcome him back for 2014. He'll be with us all year. It's Paul Harding from Martin Harding and Mazzotti. Hey, Paul. Hey, good morning, guys. Good morning. Hey, Happy New Year. How was it? You know, it, it was great. It's a blur. Uh, you know, the kids are kids are kind of off, and I find myself almost off, even though, uh, you know, I, I still work, but uh, still <laughs> like felt like, it's been a two-week vacation, so it felt good getting back yesterday. I, I, I think that being off with the kids really reorganizes one's priorities. And I mean that. I'm, I'm not even joking. Yeah. I yeah. have no idea what like, you're talking about. I know about. you please, don't, please but I'm, I'm talking to another mature adult on the telephone here. I'm and Paul understands. It's like with the stress of work gets to you. It's like, yeah, you got this family at home that's pretty awesome, you know? Oh, there yeah. you go. No, it, it puts it in perspective, and then it also puts it in perspective. That you know, kind of heading off to work every now and then can be kind of a break. See, that's oh, what I was going to say. I think you guys are saying saying that other stuff just to make yourself feel totally. I better about like hating 10, it. Twelve hour days. Yeah. <laughs> yes, <laughs> right. yes. Right. Get home, sleep, come right. right back to work. Hey, so tomorrow it's the state of the state by the governor, and he's going to make this big announcement about maybe opening up uh, the state of New York for medical marijuana and having twenty different hospitals be able to dispense it we wanted paul to come on here and ask the question is he kicking the door open for the possible uh legalization of marijuana yes you know he he is and as to where it goes in this state you know i've looked at the other states there's 20 states that allow medical marijuana and of course colorado now has gone full blown recreational use and um and there's been an incremental component to the lax standards in most of the states. So what he's starting with here, and maybe it's the end game, but what, he, what, we, what we're going to see tomorrow is going to be an outline of something pretty restrictive, but yet, uh, yeah, as you say, the, the door is open. It's never been open before. Uh, the folks who are in uh, you know, serious medical we're Condition talking. We're talking about uh, you know terminal stuff. I mean, really yeah. major, coma. major league issues, not yep. like you know ADHD uh, or depression or anything yeah. like that. Yeah, right. Yeah. But why? Yeah, but why what, is, do you have to take these steps? Like, who is he appeasing by taking these steps? Why can't he just go? Hey, let's go full recreational. Well, you know, he's looking to keep winning elections. You know, and he wants to kind of get it out there yeah. and maybe show the public that 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 things don't fall apart. That, that life is as it was the day before he allowed this to happen. And, and maybe some of the good stories will come out where people have had relief during these during these times. And then we have a situation where... Wait, again, wait, Paul, let me just really, before you go on, let me just go back. Please. You said stress. I mean, do, do we know if it's going to be stuff like that, like psychological so stuff? Yeah, we know it's not. Oh, we, we know, know it's, it's not. not. Okay, good. You so know, I California, make sure. I remember walking through California through just a, it was just a boardwalk, and I saw, this two years ago, and I saw like a tent. Put up and it was a doctor. He had a coat on, and he looked like a doctor, a young doctor. And it said, "Medical marijuana." Are, are you stressed out? I mean, that was it. Are you stressed out? Well, look, Medical I lived there marijuana. for two years. I had a card. It was great. I, you know, yeah. What well, did yeah. you say to get it? My actual doctor. My actual uh, what do you a call real it? doctor? My real doctor. You know, the same guy that you know does those uh, awful things to you. And, you know, literally gave me the thing. You go down there and you you pick and choose. And frankly, they have marijuana for every kind of thing. And and the, yeah. some of the things that I wanted it for worked. So, you know, so, there's some truth to all yeah. this. So even California that is that liberal still has what we call medical marijuana, not recreational use. Here in New York, it's going to be limited, you said, to 20 facilities. Again, the first few doctors who are doing this are going to be highly scrutinized. Right. And so it, it's, it, it's a crack in the door. Maybe at this far it will go. But at least we've kind of caught up with the, almost the majority of the states here that are that are looking at this. And I think once New York falls, we're going to see you know nearly uh, you know, probably the next five or ten are going to go kind of quickly because a lot of the states do look to New York for policy cool. decisions. But the governor decided that he's going to go this way, executive order. Uh, they didn't think it would pass the state uh, Republican Senate Senate Republicans, and. So you know he's, he's going out a bit of a limb here, and uh, he did, now he's now going to see how it goes and how how the community is affected by by this. All right, it's Paul Harding from Martin Harding and Mazzotti, one eight hundred Law ten ten and one eight hundred Law ten ten dot com. I mean, it's just a wild guess, but from his announcement tomorrow about medical marijuana to full blown recreational weed, five years, ten years, no, twenty years, no, much shorter, shorter, Paul, much shorter. Just a guess. I think. I think well, his, historically, you know, every year they chipped away at it in other states, right? But you know, we're here in New York, and again, we have a very, and that would be legislatively done. See, now he's got this, there's going to be a law 
But now it's going to be controlled by the legislator. They, they've, done it, they've done it through referendum where they kind of put out an election. Who wants you know, recreational marijuana? And in, in Colorado, 55% said yes, and that's what happened. Look, it's going to be a money thing. They're going to see how much money these other states are making. It's going to be bucks wow. a day. And it's going to, yeah, yeah, it's going to go boom. It's going to be a lot quicker than it was at the beginning. There'll be casinos. The right, there'll right. be marijuana. There'll be casinos. It's going to, yeah, they're opening it. It's the Wild West. Well, becoming, maybe uh, we can all get together and work on our uh, our, our ailments together kids someday. Smoking yeah. cigarettes, <laughs> moms on stripper poles. Oh, it's a great <laughs> country. <laughs> Turn it into Vegas East. Yeah. Paul Harding, one eight hundred Law ten ten. Paul, thanks for joining us. By the way, did the uh, phone? Did you do the phone thing for New Year's this year? Cabs. Yeah, oh, you cabs? we did. We did. Yeah, we gave away hundreds of free cab rides on Huge New Year's success. Eve. Um, we had about sixteen operators. I I was there for a while. There was a time when I would kind of stay right up but i, I didn't mm-hmm. i didn't make it too long but well, that's uh, yeah a, that's a great thing you guys program. do awesome that's awesome, an awesome thing, thing well, you thank guys you. do we'll talk thank to you again you. next week all right buddy sounds great guys thank Thanks, you Bob. log on listen loud classic rock and quinn and cantera at iheartradio.com